look for ways to identify women who have a complete nodal response in the axilla because we might be able to spare the, the morbidity of an x-ray lymph node dissection. So I think the emphasis is more on identifying people who've had a really nice response to chemotherapy and have, have no cancer left than identifying those who have residual cancer because our default is already to remove the lymph nodes. If we could accurately predict who doesn't have any cancer left, then perhaps we could spare some women in node dissection. We'll use targeted therapy to decide whether they need an, a completion x-ray lymph node dissection. So we know that 40% of women who are clinically node positive become pathologically lymph node negative after chemotherapy. And I think using targeted surgery, we may be able to identify those women and spare them an axillary lymph node dissection.